things second only to knowing the Lord scripture demands that if you are a believer indeed your life must be able to command such dimension of extraordinary results because like you have been taught here your results matter to God and your results matter to the project kingdom come it is impossible to establish his purposes when your life is void of authentic results this is important John 15 and verse 8 the Bible says herein is our father glorified John 15 8 here is is our father glorified when ye bear much fruit he says so shall ye be my disciples John 15 16 it says you have not chosen me but I have chosen you and ordained you that you should go and bring forth fruit and that your fruit should remain hallelujah God desires that we bear fruit it says so let your light so shine before men Matthew chapter 5 uh, and then verse 16 it says let your light so shine before men that they may see he wants them to see they may see your good works the extraordinary results that come out of and from your Christian experience look up the greatest way to market a product is truth you have no fear if what you are proposing is the truth when you are marketing a product a, a gadget or some kind of thing if you know that you are exaggerating what you claim that product can achieve you will be afraid of someone discovering the truth but your confidence is based on the truthfulness of what you are proposing. Are we still together? Believers chicken out and they lack confidence because they themselves are not yet sure. They are not yet sure of all the things that we claim that God is and all the things that we claim God is able to do. The apostle said, but I know whom I have believed. He says, and I am persuaded persuaded hallelujah and so your results matter you must come to that recognition that God desires that consistently from your life there be an unending effulgence of the supernatural manifestations of the possibilities of the kingdom this is not an exclusive preserve for preachers it is the heritage of every believer in Christ most people are not trained in church so they do not know and when you do not know you cannot have expectation you learned that last week are we together now it is important for you to know that you are on if it is true that you are part of this kingdom come project your life must command results say in the name of Jesus shout it say in the name of Jesus I decree and I declare that my life will produce extraordinary results one more time say in the name of jesus i decree and i declare that my life must command extraordinary results what manner of man is this they said that even the winds and the waves obey him jesus called their attention not by calling them he called their attention by allowing for a spectacular display there was such a manifestation of God in a man. Until then, their only consolation were prophecies of prophets and happenings before their arrival. They were full of stories of things God did. I hope you know theologically speaking that from Malachi to Matthew was about a period of 400 years. It was called a dark face in the history of the church. They never encountered God. They were completely alienated. No prophets nothing that was a, a semblance of god people were allowed to shadow box their way that's why when jesus came and went to the temple they had turned the temple to a place of business because there was no power there was no light so instead of wasting the building they turned it into a marketplace and jesus made a scourge and threw them out and said have you not read that this house you see that you have turned it into a business enterprise 
uh, that it shall be a house of prayer for all nations in other words the possibilities of god should tabernacle within this place i forbid you from living a fruitless christian life i forbid you from living a barren christian life where people consistently have to keep questioning is it true that is the god of heaven you serve is it true that is the god of heaven no 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 even if you serve the devil eventually there will be a semblance of results at least janice and jambas had the ability to turn a serpent a stick to a serpent i reject a powerless generation in the name of jesus listen let me tell you this results are very important for two reasons number one they act as consolations to your christian experience you have been taught that our pursuit uh, for god and for spiritual things is not all about results our ultimate pursuit is to know him like paul said but but that in the dealings of god with men there is a very unique consolation that results bring to people you can serve god when you are poor but you will serve God better when you are blessed. Is that true? You can serve God when you are stagnated in the midst of pain. But you serve God better. You, In fact, you serve God best when you have the liberty to be able to serve him freely. The Bible says, listen, it says, He that told you have asked for nothing. It says, ask and you will receive that your joy may be full imagine the excellency of your spiritual life when you can import the possibilities of god and bring it to your family your unbelieving family that has mocked god before your face and then day one they keep recording like a secretary day one healing day two breakthrough day three deliverance day four speed day five restoration at the end of it they'll have to drop their pen and say who is this god are you paying attention now yes sir our evangelism is poor and we keep begging and moving around because every witness is not a valid witness until you have an evidence i have taught you this that when you go to the court of law your witness may not be strong until you present an evidence so peter was standing before the jerusalem council making defense of his faith and the man who was crippled was standing next to him and the people could not dispute that miracle what evidence do you have that becomes a backing to all your speakings when you say god is faithful where is the proof not everybody is a spiritual man the greeks seek for a sign listen they will come to the well like the woman at the well they will not come to the well because of jesus they will come to the well because of your results then when they come to the well they will encounter jesus now their convictions will now be greater than the results but that which attracts is the excellency of the workings of god in your life look up please how do you think people get into cultism have you ever seen a cultist carrying a placard and say today we are on evangelism have you seen that happen but perpetually they keep recruiting people why because of a semblance of results have you seen a herbalist group themselves as a team and say we are going around abuja or around our villages in fact most of the herbalists that cause mayhem are never really seen and yet their impact cannot be denied because of results shout results let the devil hear you shout results I'm here to provoke you tonight to shake away every excuse that has kept you down all kinds of explanations listen there are many people whose growth whose salvation is at the mercy of your results that includes your family that includes all those around you your workplace that includes the members of your church the bible says the ns expectation of creation awaited the manifestation not the excuses herein is my father glorified when you bear much fruit when you bear much fruit that you come from a family where no one has risen and you hear these arrogant demonic people make statements like nobody will rise from your family you don't need to start jumping let your results answer 
that there is a cause that has tied everybody in that family that nobody will rise no matter where they go to you cannot argue with results and then you send the children of the Habalists to school on your scholarship and tell him this is a token of righteousness Jesus sends rain to the righteous and the unrighteous let your children go to school while we keep hoping for your own repentance are we together demonic appearances people go to bed in the night and cannot sleep by morning you think they've rested it was a wrestle this time is not jacob's kind of wrestle wrestle with demons principalities and with one decree like jesus made over the sea peace be still and an age-long calm is restored in your family they will start looking for names to explain the supernatural like pastor like whatever it is and they are right because the bible says they shall call you ministers of our god listen ladies and gentlemen from this night your life will begin to command extraordinary results i'm prophesying it to someone in the name of jesus the resurrected king may your life command such phenomenal results it for as long as your life is not producing results do not rest no it is foolishness to be in a state of rest rest there means with no passion to press when your life has not produced a requisite level of result there is a labor dimension in the kingdom in prayer the labor dimension in the word that you do not rest until there is that establishment poverty all around your family and you fold your arms as if everything is all right is that the will of god no. No. are we together arguments day and night because of money this one steals blames this one husband blames wife and you can come in as an ambassador no long sermon i come in the name of the lord it says blessed is he that cometh in the name of the lord and you calm the family down and in a moment using the tool of economy you preach a message that is sound and end all these devilish arguments once and for all next time you are going to church they will say can we come does that look to you like micah chapter 2 it says it shall come to pass in the last days that the mountain of the lord's house shall be exalted above every other mountain and above the hills is that true and it says nations shall run to it that they will tell one another come let us go to the house of jacob he said for there he will teach us his ways it's important that our christian life stop being inert and passive no we are in an active mission revealing jesus and if you are really interested in jesus this jesus project cannot happen by folding your arms so listen i have given you an orientation in this ministry that when we advocate results it's not just a mundane search to heal yourself from failure the project is beyond proving a point that you are not a failure no that the program of god is result dependent do not downplay the problems that plague men in our world. Nobody will follow you anywhere if your life does not have results. I guarantee you. They may like you because they are related to you. They may console you out of their life. But if you want genuine followership to Jesus, it will be at an instance of results. Again, let me speak to someone. Whatever has made people run away from you, your Jesus. The version of Jesus you have been presenting that has been sending more people to hell because they cannot see the evidence the workings of the spirit i declare from tonight begin to command extraordinary results please be seated Moses, 
Moses that you read in the Bible watch this Moses said do not let us depart from here if your presence will not go with us listen very carefully it says how shall they know please help me honor Reverend Akila such a pleasant surprise blessings to you sir house on the rock just hallelujah if your life is bankrupt of results you will only create a basis for debates that will keep planting unbelief are we together now let me tell you the truth forget about what ignorant people say results are powerful powerful let me repeat again genuine results results of healing results of salvation results of favor find a man whose life is an expression of results and i show you where argument comes to an end and end with a full stop when jesus hung upon the cross he made three interesting statements it is finished and any devil that wants to add a comma to that statement the power of God has been guaranteed to protect that statement. It is finished. Shame is finished. Disappointment finished. Years of crying without solution is finished. Yes. You have to believe this. There are families coming to church and once you gather yourselves to go to the house of God, here comes the mockers who come in the spirit of Sambalat and Tobias, stopping you from building what God is building and they mock at you and say, at least we are, it's very clear that we do not love Jesus. But you who is a worker in church, you who is passionate ah, in this season, may my God use your results to answer many in the name of Jesus Christ.